I am fishing the south side of Topsail Island today. I've got some mud crabs with me and I'm hoping to look for some sheep set along these pilings. Tide's dropping and so there's not much water here at these docks. So I'm going to go to these old pilings I know of and uh, see if I might be able to get some sheep set there. I also have a bait, another big old mean crab. It's not happy he's with me. Maybe he'll get me a big, uh, big black drum or something. It's my first day using my Bix BJ2 motor, and I've already had some really uh, nice results with that. I'll power this motor up, see how fast I can get that. Oh, I also want to say thank you so much for 5,000 subscribers. It just rolled over last night. I was really excited in April to get to 1,000, and it just went to 5,000 like that. So thank you all so much. All right, y'all, so I found this sea urchin on these rocks. It's dead. Um, so I heard that they make good baits. So I'm gonna go ahead and try this sea urchin by these pilings if I can get up to them. The current is really ripping right out right now. I don't know how to cook this thing. First flight NC treat rig. All right, here we go. but uh, I don't have them. So we'll see what I can do with this. This wind's gonna be a problem for me. I might've gotten myself into a spot here. It won't be worth it if there's a big fish on the other end of this. Ha <laughs> ha. Go ahead, throw it in this current, see if anything crazy comes. Hopefully, if I get something, it doesn't pull me into this water. Hey, child, I think I got myself out of that mess. We'll get back to this creek, back behind the, the island here. Nice and calm. I'm glad to get back here and find some reds before the tide's out. Getting home is going to be tricky. Oh well, the things we have for fish. Alright, y'all, so on the back. Alright, so I'm looking at, I'm looking at this bank over here. Um, it's deeper water. There's um, stuff emptying out from these flats here. So I'm hoping that there might be some fish hanging out over there. Hey y'all, so I was getting only like little nibbles from little fish back in that other spot, so I kind of a little bit further down the creek, found a little more shelter from the wind, and I think there's some bigger fish in here, but I don't really know. They might just be jumping mullet. Might be another one of those days for me. I'm getting some things just yanked right off the hook. My crab. Ooh. Ooh, swirls. I'm not really sure what all is out here. Well, we'll see what happens. All right, y'all, I got nothing but crabs back here. So, I'm pulling in and heading out. And we'll try a different plan. I have a little fish, y'all. Little fish, I don't know what it is. Oh, it's a lizard fish, son of a bitch. Well, there we go. Now I know what's eating all the bait out here. That's a lizard fish, they're so gross. <laughs> That might be what has been in here eating all the bait. So let's get out of here. Oh, 
Lizardfish day. Y'all, I just spooked some red drop. Fog. Physically solid. Shaking its head back. It's a good fight on this fish. Big, big drum. Oh, yeah. Oh, I need for this, y'all. I need to catch this. This is real shallow water, and I got this on a mud bin now. My battery died. I'm so looks like it's still recording. Big drum. Hell yeah. Oh, it's time to go home now. I've been looking all afternoon for this thing. Five hours probably. It is drumming away too. Let's measure it. So you don't lose a uh, fish on a kayak. Lip grips. All right. fish y'all 25 inches that is a nice fish <laughs> nice fish so exciting all right well I can't find my stringer so I'm gonna go ahead and bleed it out here um, just so it's not suffering y'all well I'm happy with that drum and I got to get it home because I don't have ice on on the kayak so I've got to hurry my butt back I'm gonna go ahead and motor it on back all right y'all so today started out a little tough uh, I went to work really hard to get that fish I had some frustrating hours there in the beginning not finding anything but you just have to stick with it you know and if you're like I can't find any fish here then pick up and try to go somewhere else I almost gave up I was literally heading back. I was like, let me check this little spot on my way back. And man, what a great feeling. Oh, this motor is cool, man. I could like barely cut it. This is a game changer. It's called a, a Big Speed J2. And I will do a video specific to the motor. And I also recorded my insulation, DIY insulation on the rudder. So I'll make sure to include all of that ultimate kayak mod. 